Nicki Minaj, the queen of rap, was on her way to Manchester, England, for a highly anticipated concert on her Pink Friday 2 World Tour. Fans were buzzing with excitement, but their anticipation turned into shock when news broke that Nikki had been arrested in the Netherlands. The reason? Possession of soft drugs. As Nikki was traveling from Amsterdam to Manchester, she found herself in an unexpected predicament at Skip Hall Airport. Police detained her, causing an immediate uproar among fans and media alike. Nikki, whose real name is Onika Tanya Miraj Petty, was scheduled to perform that very night in Manchester. Unfortunately, the concert had to be postponed, leaving thousands of fans disappointed. Nikki's journey didn't end at the airport. She was taken to a police station to make a statement about her security. In an Instagram Live, she filmed herself being directed into a van by police officers, further escalating the drama. Her post on X mentioned, I had to go five miles away to make a statement about my security to the police precinct. Did they say? Second. Tell me again. The police officer told me we have to offload all the luggage okay. and to search everything okay. of your luggage. I'm so sorry to, to say that. But isn't that what you planned on doing from the get-go? Why didn't you guys search it before it went on the plane? Uh, they did a, just a random a quick check, but now they want to open Why? it. And first of all, because you filmed him and he was like... Because I filmed bit, him? Yeah, he was like... Uh, he. Do, he doesn't believe you that you don't have more with you than you say. No, he asked me, do I have any more in those purses? And I said, no. And yeah. I asked him, where are my bags? They took my bags and put it on the plane before I could know what bags are on the plane. I see. Yeah. So. I'm so sorry for that. Okay, of course. During this live broadcast, Nikki remained defiant and vocal about her treatment, gaining even more support from her fans. The incident at the police station added another layer to the unfolding drama, with Nikki maintaining her stance that she was being unfairly targeted. After hours of questioning and procedures, Nikki was released from custody and fined. The police allowed her to continue her journey, but the damage had already been done. Her Manchester concert was postponed, and fans were left with their plans disrupted. Live Nation UK, the concert promoter, issued a statement saying, despite Nikki's best efforts to explore every possible avenue to make tonight's show happen, the events of today have made it impossible. We are deeply disappointed by the inconvenience this has caused. They assured fans that tickets would remain valid for the rescheduled concert, but the disappointment was palpable. As the news spread, fans and media outlets worldwide reacted with a mix of shock, anger, and support for Nikki. Social media platforms were flooded with hashtags like Free Nikki and Justice for Nikki, showcasing the power of her fan base. The incident quickly became a trending topic, with everyone from casual listeners to diehard barbs weighing in. Media outlets dissected every detail. From the initial arrest to the conspiracy theories, analysts debated the implications for Nikki's tour and her public image. Despite the controversy, one thing was clear. Nicki Minaj remained a powerful and influential figure, capable of commanding global attention. In the end, while this incident was undoubtedly a major hiccup in Nicki Minaj's tour, it also demonstrated her resilience and the unwavering support of her fans. The story is far from over, and we'll be keeping a close eye on how it unfolds. Stay tuned for more updates and insights. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the latest Nicki Minaj drama, Make sure to hit that subscribe button for more exclusive content. Don't forget to like, comment, and turn on post notifications so you never miss an update. Your support helps us bring you the best in entertainment news.